What's up everybody, Man Cave Dave here in Michigan with the pickups video. We just got back from doing Mott Con at Mott Community College in uh, Flint, Michigan. Uh, it was their first ever con, it was a lot of fun, so big shout out to Alicia, Casey, and the whole Mott Con crew for their hospitality. Uh, it was, it was uh, a lot of fun to be able to support them with that, and uh, uh, just a great setup. Um, they had come up to Baycon, which is a con I do at Bay College, and uh, uh, checked it out a few times, and... Um, just a just great group and thank you again guys it was a lot of fun uh, so this is some stuff that i picked up a while back actually at bacon and a little bit after from my friend steve so steve uh, thank you so much for reaching out uh, steve big huge uh <laughs> just a huge fan of star wars uh, has a great podcast on it and i was looking to downsize some of his collection and reached out and so uh, these are some of the awesome um, pieces that he um, was ready to let go of. So uh, in the back here, we have some of the bigger uh, figures, um, newer figures from the newer movies and uh, re-releases. Only one has their accessory. The TIE Pilot back there has a blaster, um, but uh, pretty neat things. I really like these micro Galaxy Squadrons. Um, not enough to, to collect the whole line, but there's a few. I might have to hang on to these three. I don't know. We'll see. But the Razor Crest, uh, the Millennium Falcon, and um, Slave One or, or Boba Fett Starship. I actually think I have these already, but uh, they're just kind of neat and very well built. They remind me of the, um, oh, what was it, the, the ones that came out in the 90s, early 2000s. We have an X-Wing and uh, Darth Vader's um, TIE Fighter. So, um, yeah, they're just uh, pretty neat. Then we have some Black Series figures. Sorry about the glare. Um, some of these were open and displayed, and then some of them uh, are brand new. Um, Steve took really good care, does take really care, good care of his figures. Uh, but just some really some neat ones here. Um, and then some of the Retro line. Chopper. That's a fun one. And uh, Kersantin. I'm not sure how to say that. I like these, these uh, holiday ones those are really fun um and then over here some of the 90s re-releases these ones always crack me up because everybody looks so buff it looks like luke has been hitting the gym pretty hardcore so um yeah just a bunch of fun ones here that we'll work on getting out to some of the other collectors out there the shadows of the empire figures are pretty neat i uh, almost said neat again pretty neat pretty fun um have all of those guys already uh, but just kind of kind of cool that it was uh, you know, not in a movie, but an offshoot that they made figures on. So anyway, big thank you to Steve and uh, look for these figures coming to a show soon. Thanks for watching, everybody.